Uh, hello guys uh, welcome to this video so in this video i will show you how to fix this error message inside your react project wheat react project if you type the npx tailwind css init command so if the command is not successful if you are getting this error message this is quite normal you are going uh, you are watching the correct video in this video i will show you how to fix this error message the main reason of this command not successful guys uh, uh, as you all know tailwind has released a latest version which is tailwind css4 which is drastically different from the older version so that's why if you are using the latest version which is tailwind css4 then this command will not be successful this is only available for the older versions so this is my react weed project if you see we are using the latest version of react and we are also using wheat development engine and as you can see we are using the tailwind css 4.0.17 so this is slightly different if you uh, want to use this command as you can see this command is only available to the tailwind css at the rate 3 so now if you want to use this command you need to downgrade your tailwind css version from the latest version which is 4.0.17 to 3 so now just go to the command line and just simply downgrade the version and just write this command at the rate 3 so just add this npm i dash g for adding it as a dev, dev dependency tailwind css at the rate 3 so this will actually downgrade your tailwind css and it will download the older version which is 3.4.17 so just make this change and if you again type the same command npx tailwind css init if you type the same command now hopefully the command will work it will actually on the left hand side it will create these two files you will see created tailwind css config file you can see it has created this file here tailwind config.js file so in this easy way guys you can fix this error message you just need to downgrade your tailwind css if you are using the latest version you just need to downgrade to the third it is also mentioned on their documentation as well so if you go to it you will see they have this is the version 4 which is the latest version but this is actually the 3.4.17 version so this command will work only this tailwind css 3 version so in the latest version they have drastically changed the structure if you want to use the tailwind css 4 then this is slightly different but if you want to use that command this command then you just need to downgrade that inside your that i showed you the command here so you just need to use this version 3.4.17 so hopefully the error was fixed by watching this video guys so if the error has been fixed then please hit that like button subscribe to channel as well and also check out my website freemediatools.com uh, which contains thousands of tools regarding audio video and image and i will be seeing you in the next video